The floodlights are beaming down on the players here at Stamford Bridge in West London. My name is Derek Ray, and sitting alongside me in the commentary position is the former Arsenal and West Ham midfield player Stuart Robson. And what we have for you tonight is live Champions League group stage match day one action. It's Chelsea versus Dinamo Zagreb. Thanks, Derek. Well, the hosts are clear favourites going into this tie. But with that comes pressure, particularly against a team that will remain compact, are well drilled defensively and are a threat on the counter-attack. If the hosts don't go through, though, it will be a major upset. And here's how it looks for Chelsea. Kepa stands between the posts. Kadiju Koulibaly plays alongside Thiago Silva in central defence. Mateo Kovacic starts alongside Jorginho in the centre of midfield. And the main threat in attack today should be Pierre-Emerick Aubameyang. This is how the visitors will set up today. Well, it's a 4-3-3 formation with a centre forward and two wingers. So it's important that the midfield players give support to the striker whenever the ball goes wide. They can't allow him to be isolated. It's the opening match day. Champions League group stage match day one underway. It is to be a throw-in. Fine work from Chelsea to win the ball back. A glorious chance. In it goes. An early goal. No wonder they're celebrating. Well, here's the replay, and you see it was a good finish. But the keeper at his near post has to do a lot better. He's got to have that near post covered for me. Mišić, Bruno Petkovic, just looking for the right moment for that final pass. And players waiting in the centre, and with that, the attack fizzles out. And showing fine vision. Mount. Onto Aubameyang. Well, not the greatest pass, easily intercepted. Aubameyang, is this the moment? He's blocked it! Who's going to get on the end of it? Well, did his job defensively. Mount. He's got to score! Well, he had a lot of ground to cover. Splendid save. <laughs> Playing it in. 
He must struggle to get it away properly. Sterling. Koulibaly. On to Sterling. So now a corner. Played over. Well, I think it's fair to say the pressure from the defender put him off a bit. Mishic. And he's won the ball. The Chelsea move still flowing. Advantage to them. Sterling. On to Jorginho. Can he put it in? And he did so well to move across and deal with the danger. Well, it has to come soon. They're creating so many chances. Just listen to the noise inside here. Short corner it is. Mount. Koulibaly. Oh, good work by the keeper. And over comes the corner. Well, here's another look at it. Certainly delivery into the box couldn't have been any better. And then what a great finish as well. Good connection with the ball, leaving the keeper with little chance. It's a great goal. And the ball is moving again. 2 0 is how it stands. A chopping challenge, and the referee has got to have a big think about it. And a yellow card for that, Stewart. And he's going to have to be careful now. That was a silly challenge. And they deal with the threat this time. Well, approaching half-time on the home side, very much in charge here, Stuart. Your thoughts? Well, from an attacking point of view, it's been a very good performance. I really like the way they've got the ball from back to front, then how the forwards have got away from their markers and the speed of their attacks as well. It's been a really impressive first half. Very alert defending to put a stop to the chance. Well, doesn't have to do it on his own. And in with a real chance. And a goalkeeper on top of his game. Well, it's great goalkeeping. What a big save that is. He's driven in the corner. Marvellous anticipation. He's in control of the situation. Jorginho. Well, Chelsea have had so much possession, as you can see. Yes, they've played well when going forward, but it's been their ability to regain the ball which has made them so hard to play against here, and it makes them such a good team. It's been a brilliant performance so far.
as far as stoppage time is concerned three minutes here this looks interesting and space to cross it can they get in behind them well nothing productive really and the first 45 minutes have come and gone here at Stamford Bridge And I think it's fair to say he's had happier days in front of goal, Stuart. Yeah, you're right. He needs to impose himself on this game. He just hasn't done enough to get away from his marker so far. Unless that changes, they're going to struggle to turn this one around. And so the second half of this Champions League group stage match day one contest commences. Oh, nice ball. How about the cross? He read the situation defensively and did his job. Chilwell it's with Cody Bally Sterling well he's going to be disappointed with that pass well, racing away here Mislav Orsic and teammates to play it to must score Great reflex action. Well, that should have been a goal. Mind you, it's a brilliant save. Well, they have elected to go to the bench at this stage of the game. Who's going to get on the end of it? Not away completely. And with that, the attack fizzles out. This might be ideal for the counter. Ariana Demi. Plenty of players waiting in the middle. No problems for the keeper. Aspili Quetta. Mateo Kovacic. play it in spot on with that tackle and into the last 20 minutes Aspili Quetta on to Jorginho Obama Yang and doing all he can to grab his second of the game. Well, he's been a real live wire today. A constant threat to this back line. <laughs> and the substitution will occur now. Short corner it is. Can he convert? And no way through. Kovacic using his strength to shield the ball pass after pass keeping their opponents moving well we're inside the final 10 minutes in this one Ariana Demi well flinging himself at it and they will make the change now
it's a short corner well strong play here played into the center and there it is all in the melting pot now and what a finale we could have in store for us Well, here's the replay, and it all starts off with that cross into the box, just begging for a teammate to get on the end of it. And it makes the striker's job so easy. All he has to do is make the right connection. It's a lovely goal. So there we have it, 2-1. Jorginho and now with Aubameyang Mateo Kovacic an effective challenge they've got to be really mindful of the time situation attacking though they might be and we are going to have two additional minutes Kukureya Jorginho now with Aubameyang. Beautifully weighted ball. Can they get in behind them? This could finish it. And in all likelihood, that is game over. So little time left for a response. Well, this is a brilliant strike, as you can see. He hits it with so much power, the keeper had no chance. Fantastic finish. So, full time it is. And a morale boosting three points on the board to begin their European campaign. Well, you always want to get off to a good start, and that's exactly what they've done here. Now they can look forward to the next game. They're in a great position. Well, he often cuts the figure of a thinking person's footballer, and Stewart, he's thought his way throughout this match. Well, I'm not concerned about him missing a few chances. The main thing is he kept on getting into the right areas, and he scored a very good goal as well.